Yo, what's good, Tristan? And Tristan from today. I'm gonna be reacting to The Weeknd Ariana Grande performing Save Your Tears at the iHeart Music Awards 2021. I've been waiting for this moment for so long. Is that Nicki Minaj? Doesn't that look like Nicki Minaj? I'm so excited that I'm literally wearing the exact same shirt. I have not even washed it yet. <sighs> smells just like Queen Cast litter box. But before we get started, be sure to check me out. Instagram, TikTok. This is the first time they're gonna be reacting to Ariana Grande since she was married. She's married in this, right? She's married. <laughs> His voice has gotten way more stable, dude. Zoom in! No, zoom in on him! My married queen. Is anyone else mad that she's married? Like, I swear to God, I had a chance. Really felt like I had a chance for a while. Now I... I don't know what to think. Oh, right. Okay, singing. Okay, um, I want to know if she is making the same changes that she made in the studio version live. I am super curious to hear if she... Yeah, I'm super curious. Super live as well. This is Ariana Grande's song now. I'm sorry, Abel. <laughs> they really gave her all the challenging parts of this song. Oh, actually, that was pretty, pretty cool. Oh, man. Holy shit. Ariana Grande stole this song. I'm sorry. We all know it's true. That was impressive, though. His voice is getting... Actually, I'm joking around, but in all fairness, his voice has gotten way stronger since back in the day. Listen to his voice here. And you know mine, the ones that love me, tend to leave behind. His voice used to be, this is like six years ago, seven years ago, his voice used to be way lighter, his larynx used to be lifted a bit higher, and he had more problems singing these like fuller, more open sounds, where here he just kind of kills it, right? He does it somewhere here. As I swear he's in this track somewhere. Right? Ariana Grande's voice has also gotten way darker. Oh, girl, you loud as hell. Holy sh... Yikes. Right here, she's more like, save, right? She's more in that part of her voice. In Dangerous Woman, she would have been more like, save, yeah. She'd be like, in this really light place, right? Obviously, she sounds not like that, but. <laughs> Complete 
switch up of her technique and her style. I actually like the darker style a little bit more. But I, it really depends on what she's singing too, right? And it depends on what she's going for. Like she would ne oh, she would never do that sound. It's like day sound where it's like this big hey. It's almost shouty, right? Ariana Grande and shouty to me never went hand in hand. Ariana Grande, her voice was light. It had a little bit of a cry on it. It had like infinite range. <laughs> And that can sometimes actually be very, very helpful. If someone is trying to go for a darker sound in their voice, it can be super nice to actually go for a lighter sound first and develop your voice that way. Not always, like you don't, you definitely don't have to do this, right? It's just a, it's just an interesting way of approaching it because then you have like a range, you have all these things unlocked. And then from there, you can start to open things up and push on them a little bit more and make them a bit fuller, still knowing that you can change things up and access that upper range if you need to. And something that's interesting about Abel, actually, I'm sorry, Ar uh, Ariana Grande does actually steal this song. I'm really sorry, <laughs> but it's true. Something I actually think is interesting watching him here. I've talked about, I've talked a number of times about how his lower range, he darkens it, right? And one way of knowing if the sound is darkened or not darkened or oftentimes can just be watching their mouth. You can tell if someone's singing with a darker sound or a brighter sound, depending on whether they're smiling or rounding their lips, right? And if you notice in your own voice, if you smile, you'll feel your larynx go up a little bit, won't you? If you go like this, fish lips, you'll feel your larynx come down and lower larynx, darker sound, higher larynx, brighter sound. Happy when I, uh, and he makes these fish lips as well. Uh. He always darkens his low range. Tingle teardrop, right? And then he's gonna go this way. You can hear it too. He's singing ah, right? Ah goes this way. Generally. His voice is so much stronger and so much more stable. It's insane. I thought that for certain during a Super Bowl performance and this really just locks it, nails it down for me. But anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed my reaction. I was a little bit all over the place today. Ariana Grande is just... Girl, why do you have to get married? God damn it. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> Congratulations, Ariana. But anyway, until next time, Tristan. And just fam. I will see you guys in the next video. Be sure you subscribe if you did like this video. Oh yeah, and check me out Instagram, Twitter. Peace out, you guys.